What is up, everybody? FishTankTV.com, YouTube channel, everything. Uh, so this is my brand new half-gallon beta tank. I do not recommend getting anything below a gallon for any fish. It doesn't matter what type it is. Uh, this is just an aquascaping video and a planting technique. Uh, so... Sorry, it's already halfway done. Uh, started with a different camera, died on me. Uh, started with this phone, my phone camera, died on me. Uh, so, starting it from halfway. Sorry about that. Uh, so, basically, this is sand, or the gravel is from the kit. It came with the kit. Uh, sand is from the 10 gallon Nagasi tank. So it's already pre-cycled. The water is from the 29-gallon tank uh, because it's the right pH and it's the water he's used to. Uh, I'm actually going to do half that water, half new water, just for a water change, you know. Uh, so I've got water sprite, fine leaf water sprite, and those are the only plants I haven't done anything with yet. Uh, so this ball right here is a marble with java moss wrapped around it over back in this corner I think you can see that is a compact sword compact twisted sword I do not know what the specific species is because when I bought it I wasn't in that that into fish I didn't know that much about plants I didn't know anything about plants really uh, I was just a guppy breeder like a ten year old guppy breeder and that's all I knew uh, but now you know I'm into everything else because if I wasn't I wouldn't be doing this video uh, so I've got sword, a dwarf, piece of dwarf sag right there, and the rest is just crypt. Cryptonine, when DT, do not quote me on that. I'm not sure if I'm doing that right, saying that right. It's uh, the variety of Lutea. Uh, it's like one of the sub-varieties of green. So uh, so everything is pre-cycled. I don't have to worry about cycling the tank. So it's good for the beta. Uh, actually came with water conditioner, so I'm really happy about that. Don't have to spend any, any more uh, money on Prime. Uh, actually, it would be a pain to measure out how much Prime I would need for this thing. Uh, that's how just, just how much, how concentrated Prime is and how good it is. Uh, so, basically what you need to know is, one, plant, even though your plants start out small, plan for, or plant your uh, plants in a plan for knowing how big they will get and how small they will, short they will stay, everything about that. How many nutrients, how much nutrients they'll need, how much light they're going to need. So basically, got my dwarf sad and my compact sword in the back because I know they're going to be the biggest. Because I know that uh, dwarf sad doesn't stay that dwar uh, small unless it is the uh, dwarf variety of sagittarius subulta. Otherwise, it's like the smallest sat or satirita, I think, to the aquarium hobby. But it is not that small, and this is the dwarf variety. Uh, you want to uh, plant, like, uh, my crypts were short to back, short in the front, tall in the back. Uh, I didn't have that much space in this tank. I took a little bit too many plants, but I have to plant the heck out of it so my, I don't have to do any water changes, and it, the beta doesn't die. Uh, it's also why I have all this water sprite. You just gotta fix that camera. Uh, sorry about that. I have to, this is a makeshift stand and everything. Like, I'm using painters, a roll of painter tape and a, uh, iPod dock. So, you know, gotta be creative when you don't have the stuff you need. So, uh, if you ever look, search up Tagashi Mono, how it's made on YouTube, you can actually see how many times he changes one of his t uh, an aquascape because he never he has to make sure is what he wants and what he knows is going to look beautiful. Even though aquascapes look crappy in the beginning, <coughs> sorry, about that, uh, they look amazing in the end if you do everything right. Might be a pain, but you know it looks cool. Uh, so got my bait over there. On the right side, uh, it's just in a container that I'm putting in there late right now. Got a uh, got two coconut caves soaking over there. 
get all the crap stuff out. Uh, I need to flip that over, actually. Uh, do do Just, yeah, you know, we'll see if there are any ta cannons in there. And if there are, to get them out. Or at least get some of them out, because I want most of it. Cannons are good. Brown tea water is good for your fish. Especially if you want a black water tank. Uh, so this tank, I was thinking about dirting it. Then I already put this gravel in it, and I didn't, I didn't, I didn't have any organic soil anywhere around, so I didn't, f I didn't do that, and I didn't, I forgot to get some eco complete or whatever soil for the tank, so I'm just gonna use the beta's ammonia, and when I was setting up this tank, I put the gravel down because I wasn't sure where I was gonna get the sand from at first. Put the gravel down. I put, I sprinkled some pH or acid buffer. Just a tiny bit because it's really concentrated because it's from Seachem, of course. Uh, just tiny, sprinkle a tiny bit in gravel. Uh, wash the gravel, obviously. And uh, I put some Seachem Flourish, just a regular Flourish in there. Don't have any XL or anything right now. Planning on getting XL though, uh, just to see how well it works. Uh, so, as you can see, it looks pretty nice right now. Not that well, or not that nice, but it'll get better. Uh, reason I put the sword in, in the uh, corner is because I, I knew it would need a lot of substrate depth and that's where all the depth was right in that corner and I knew that's where the roots would be able to survive and that's where it looked best because it'd be the tallest thing piled in the corner give the beta some place to hide the reason it's so planted is because I'm actually going to attempt to breed betas in this tank I'm gonna put the female in a tank next to the male Get him make a bubble nest. If they display to each other, put them in. Wa let them watch them mate for like an hour or two, and then as soon as they're done mating, I take the female out and move her somewhere else, just because I don't want her to die. Uh, hopefully, I can have success in breeding betas this time. Never got any uh, videos of my old attempt, which was half a ten gallon tank. Uh, you know, slowly drained it. Everything made it beta made a beautiful bubble nest, really thick. Female just didn't want to mate with him. You know, whatever. So, uh, that's pretty much it for right now. I was going to put one of the coconut caves in here, but it, they're really, they're way too big for this tank. Uh, I'm actually just going to put them in the 29 for the cockatoos. Cockatoo cichlids, Pistogramma cockatoidae, not Pistogramma cockatoid, or Pistogramma cockatoidas. People have some really weird ways to pronounce things in Latin. I'm in Latin class, so I know how to pronounce things in Latin. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, so, i got my Thin Leaf Water Sprite, my regular Water Sprite. Uh, <clears throat> I don't actually think Thin Leaf Water Sprite is actually in the same family. I'm not totally sure. I haven't looked into Water Sprite either. Uh, thinking about getting some Jungle Val. That's in a different video. Uh... So this tank's gonna be alright right now. Uh, <clears throat> actually, I think I'm gonna fill this, the rest of the water out, or up, I mean, <laughs> fill this tank up and uh, get it ready for the beta. And I think that's about it for this video, just because I'm running out of time, basically. <clears throat> I only really have like a minute left on my uh, recording time, so I'll just try to apologize if it ends abruptly so uh that's basically all you need to know about aquascaping i will definitely make another aquascaping vid video from the beginning from the very top just because i'm sorry uh, i couldn't get these other the uh, beginning videos uploaded uh i don't know why i start i didn't start with my phone in the beginning or the first place but uh sorry about that and this will just be basically uh what the beard will look like. Uh, I'm going to stop the video and then come back once the beta's inside. Alright, see you later.